And we are back. Okay, today's map is Iceland, known for its shenanigans here. And we are the first player, the white player, and um, literally all of our troops are on top of each other. We don't have a one to hit. I have to slam a four, or what I like to do when I'm in the first position sometimes is to card skip so we get the final cash in instead of the first. So we essentially put our position down here and green then takes the front of that. So I want to get out of dodge here. Um, I don't think blue slams my 12. I need to save my three, right? Uh, and I don't think they slam those. I think we simply pass. Um, and then we plump up on my, oh no, because blue wants to get his four in, right? We actually go here. So blue can move their four in and then I can get my the rest of my troops together. So that way we don't slam, we give other people a place to hit, because you're about to watch green pop off here. Green can't help himself. Um, and I'll show you the settings here in just a second. We don't want to miss any of this as green. Rolls a 13 v 7. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Yellow, poor, poor yellow loses a third of their troops. They went multi-positional and they didn't even realize. Oh, I don't want to miss anything, so hold on on the settings here. Oh my gosh. Oh, and purple slams yellow. Yellow's gonna die before they can go. Oh my god. If blue hits yellow, it's all over, dude. That is, I've never seen that before. I have never seen that everyone teams on the same per. It's happened to me on uh, the USA map, but not to this degree. I at least was able to live a couple more turns. Yellow is donezo. On top of that, green and purple, green didn't lose too much, but purple lost quite a bit for nothing there. Oh, so this is making our card skip look phenomenal. Red is stuck between blue. Contra uh, same thing here with blue. Blue's kind of stuck. Red goes here. Probably gets his card. Oh my god, would opts to hit a four instead of a one. And then cleans up purple. Does red think they're holding this? The, the bonuses are here. This massive plus two that you won't hold. This plus five for five, plus four for three, but this blizzard completely splits it. You don't even get the boomerang. The boomerang shut off there. And then this one is split as well. Oh my god, these blizzards are egregious. <laughs> oh my god. Blue doesn't get a card. He just kills yellow. He said, nope, get out. Just get out. Just get out of my lobby. Oh my lord, dude. What is this game, though? I don't think blue hits my five. So now we, every time we're just going to try to save the least amount of troops we have. And I kind of like my position right here on that 13. I'm out of the way. Now, I, now I'm going to try to save my five. I think blue's the one to beat. I don't know though. He, he killed yellow and he didn't have to. All right. The settings are as usual though. We have 60 second turn timers, expert AI, progressive cards, balance blitz dice, no alliances, no fog, no portals, but we do have blizzards. Green popping off, trying to get this middle bonus. I don't think they hold this. Ooh, do they know? If they go, yeah, red can pop them. Red's got them, I think. Oh my god, green sues red. This is why this map is just so ridiculous. Like, no one has self-control. If everyone kind of just was like, hey, we're all just kind of dancing around. We're all just dancing around trying to get cards. No, like me and blue are doing. If everyone just did what me and blue were doing, then the game might be a little bit longer, a little bit more interesting, maybe a little bit more high level. Instead, purple's like, I don't want to die. <laughs> and he doesn't do anything. That's not the right play. I think if you're purple, you try your best to get a set on three and you move forward. Purple will not be able to win the game now, but they might be able to snag a second place because they're the most unappealing. This is between us and blue, I think. This is between me and blue. Yeah. Yeah, 100%. So it's crucial that I'm trained on him. However, he sets before me now because I card skip. So if he gets a set and he's able to kill me, he might be able to win the game. Uh, does red, if red bots out, green actually gets the bonus. Wow, so Green's insanity clutch plan is going to pay off because the bot's not going to break him until next turn and he's going to have a plus five. That's intriguing to me. Yes, 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 he's still here. He's still here. Break him. Yes, let's go. 
Red player is Jean Shimada. Blue player is Lane Wadhawa. Yellow player was Gargantuan Team. Uh, we are there. Green player is General Graysteel. And purple player is General Kunda. Oh, man, this is interesting. The, the first time I played this map, I only had uh, four players. I only had four players here, so I wanted to add the full six. Uh, just blue suit by 18. I was about to say, high roller. Big boy roller there. Okay, my, my five is locked now, so I'm going to have to move my 18. Ooh, this is good. Oh, no, I have to connect. If I want to connect the five, that means blue does have access. But that is a okay we're gonna move one we do lose one unfortunately but we cash in on the five and now our stack is bigger than blues blues trapped here is really nice i like having that trap there uh let's see if the car if the sets get big enough we can nab purple for an extra card if we get stuck on four that would be really tactical okay green does that but doesn't realize red can still break <laughs> uh and so can blue okay purple does purple wake up or does he just pass does purple wake up or does he? Yeah, baby. Get in the game. Oh, I like that. I like that a lot. So he hits blue's four, making it impossible for blue to retaliate with his 19. However, blue might just be like, oh, I'm going to slam something. And then he hits me. I don't know. But now purple has two cards and is looking extra yummy if we just do this for two. But I don't know if we want to roll a nine just yet. I'm hoping, um, yeah, red is going to keep trimming green. We actually have a kill guard on red. We actually have a kill guard, so if green wins here and eliminates red, we kill red and get the cards. So actually, I feel like we're in a pretty good position here. I feel like we are. Man, I really enjoy the six man on this map, so I'm glad we did that. Red goes here, breaks. Absolutely. Yeah, green, there's no way green holds this. Um, red says, nope, get out of dodge, and he trims green to nothing. So green and red are going to lose this game. They're just saying who finishes higher. That was kind of a rough roll. Yeah, red is not very killable now this next turn because green would have to do some gymnast. Well, actually, he could go bang, bang, boomerang, boomerang, bang, bang. But then I kill him on the eight, right? All right. My only thing with this kill guard is if red is like, you know what? I don't like being kill guarded here. I'm just going to pop off and slam my stack. He could do that. I don't think he will. Blue is completely lined on me. I don't appreciate that. I think, yeah, blue is my rival. I don't need to hit green. I need, I like this position the most. If I hit this, I'm still open to blue, but it's less open to purple. So I'm actually going to hit this one. All right, perfect. That way we still have a kill guard. We still have a line to purple and we still have a line to blue. If blue sets and sues into me, that's how I lose this game. We have a set on three though. We have a set on three. So either I let everyone set first or I just go ham. And it looks like green might do that boomerang action we were talking about. And that means if red doesn't set, we kill red for four cards. Okay. Interesting. Ooh. I mean, red still makes that. <laughs> green is so funny to me. He's like, yeah, I'm going to get this bonus. I'm going to get this bonus if it's the last thing I do. Um, purple gets another card here and is incredibly killable on three, but the sets haven't come in yet. So I don't know if we do that. Maybe blue. No, I'm kill guarding blue. Yeah. Oh no. He goes like this, right? Bang, bang, bang. Yeah. Blue was there. Blue was there. You go, go boom, boom, boom. Blue could kill purple and set, but if he gets a bad roll on the 10, he loses, right? That's the whole thing. It's blackmail. It is straight blackmail. If I was blue, I would be begging for a set, and then I would kill me. I would kill white ASAP. I would 100% kill white as soon as possible. Okay. I need blue. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Perfect. Me and blue are just trading back and forth. Yeah, blue's the best. Blue is the best by far. The funniest thing is I could kill blue. I could get rid of the competition. Oh. <sighs> if I get bad dice on that 22, no, because then purple kills. Well, purple's locked. Red, red could say and kill me. Yeah, we don't do that. Dude, I'm really thinking about it, though. 
All right, I'm gonna set next turn most likely. Me and Blue just trade. All right, hopefully, I don't. I think Blue might win this. I think Blue might win this. Blue might do it. Green goes really quick. Okay. I got a bad feeling about Blue suing. Red locked their seven as well, which isn't ideal. Oh, if Green had just put his troops here, it would have blocked Red unless Red sets. Red could very well set on four. Purple sets on four for safety, but locks his troops? No, you want to get a card, right? Ooh. He, oh, purple's garbage. Yeah. Yeah, purple's bad. All right, buddy. That's all right. He, so purple has no cards. Purple has a locked 16 stack with no cards. Oh, my God. Iceland, save me. All right, if red stuck on five, that might be an interesting take for us. Um... But really, I think it's if blue is stuck on five, we put blue down. Because purple can't retaliate. Red is stuck. Um, green is not... Oh, green is easy to kill on five, actually. Ooh, we kill green? We kill green, we set? That would be interesting. Mm, we lose the kill guard on red, though. Oh, everyone's so stuck on cards, my guy. Blue comes in. Blue doesn't set. Oh, dude, Blue's the best player, though. I think I need to take him out. Can I set? Kill Blue. Wait a second. No, there's no way I can kill Blue and Green. Purple's non-existent. Let's see how many troops I have here. I wasn't willing... I think I kill Blue. Either I kill Blue or I kill Green. I think I kill green and get all those cards back. Yeah, I'm gonna kill green. Oh, I lost 16 on his 12. Lord have mercy on me. Lord have mercy on me. Oh, but he had two wild. Wait, what? Wait, what? He had two wild cards? Are you truffling me? Are you truffling me? Oh, I don't want to get... Oh, I want to kill guard red from blue. But I'm not going to because I don't trust it. I have my 20 locked, but someone's going to break me, right? Either way, I have a set on four because of two wild cards. Okay, we lost 16 on his 12. I get away from blue. I don't think blue can kill me. He can sue, but I don't think he can kill me. Let's see. He might go for... Maybe red can put up, like, a blockade. Maybe red... Red breaking might inadvertently slow down blue. Okay. I actually wouldn't mind red breaking if he can somehow block me from blue. So if red could occupy this by the end of his turn, that would kind of clog up the lane. Yes. Good man. Okay, can you get your 18 back to home? Can you go like this and leave it here? Oh, dang. Oh, dang it. Okay. If blue sets, he might kill me. Kind of like I did with green. Oh, blue. The game is in your hands. He knows it is. Okay. 36 troops plus three. 39? Is that a 30? Oh, he could kill me. He kills me. He sets. Oh, I think he's got it. Oh, I think blue's got it. I think blue's good. I think blue's good. I would go for it, man. If you don't do it, you lose. I would go for it. I'd go for it right now. He's thinking about it. Yes. You got to go a little bit quicker. Oh, he's thinking about who... Oh, he's going for purple. No, he's going for the worst bonus in the game. Oh, blue. Okay, I really thought blue was good, but he went for a plus two. That sucks. A seven for plus two. Okay. But he leaves my 22 locked like a man. I like that. All right, we set. We still have a wild card. I can just about kill. Okay. Interesting. Blue's still open to me whether I break him or not. I don't even need to break him, dude. It's a plus two. I don't care about your plus two. I don't care about your plus two, brother. Um...
I don't know what I want. Okay, I actually I do. Okay. This is a good kill guard. Red breaks me, unlocks my 39, I kill him. Blue breaks me, I kill everyone. <laughs> Look at that, purple is gonna break blue anyway. Okay, okay. Now, if they have sets on three, I might be in trouble from suicides, but I will get a guaranteed set on three. I will get a guaranteed set on three. Red needs to set and, and wreck me. If not, I get a bonus, which is pretty cool. Unfortunately, if no one hits me, I'm locked again, but again, I will have a set on three the next turn, so it won't matter. I'll fortify and, and plump up. And inadvertently, I block Red's kill in case he does get stuck on cards, so Blue can't go bang, boom, boom, boom if I was here or back there on the island. Red has a lock stack. This is terrible. This is much better, but is in between two stacks. He takes his one. Takes his one. So Blue is still the best player, but he's much worse than I thought he was. Blue should have just killed me there, man. He would have got all those cards, and then he could have easily beat uh, Red and Purple in a 1v1. Easily. Instead, he went for a two, a plus two for seven, my guy. My guy. All right, red goes, red stuck on four. Red stuck on four. Blue sets for 20. He kills purple, right? He replenished, oh. Oh wait, he can kill me. Oh, he kills me, minus three. Oh no, he kills me, he kills me, he kills me! Oh, we lose to blue, blue was good! <laughs> no way! Oh my god! Oh no, but he feeds the game! He feeds the game to red in purple! Purple, I'm sorry, red sets and kills blue now, what a man's jam, dude! That's what he should have done the other turn, but he's like, you know what? I'm going to do it this turn. Oh. Oh, wow. Wait, so how could we have combated that? I don't think we could have. I think the fact he just set on three was GG. Yeah, I think I don't think we could because he just had enough troops to kill everyone. We were on two. We got my troops into position. Um... Like, it didn't matter where I put my troops, right? He had that many to kill me, and he had a perfect line. Red kills purple, and red beats blue. Let's go, dude. <laughs> what a hilarious fourth place finish. So blue would rather give me fourth than let me win. I respect that. He knew. He knew who the threat was, and now red gets the win. Red gets the win. That is so hype. Oh, my gosh. Oh, Red, please don't botch this, though. You got to split now. Oh, Red botches if blue sets. Oh, my God. What a fantastic loss on the channel. Do the boomerang. Okay. Oh, my dude. I was feeling... I did say, like, three minutes ago, the only way I lose if, is if blue sues on me. That's exactly what happened. So... Oh, Red could have won the game there. Oh, man. Red is so bad. Can blue set in clutch? Oh my god, blue's still gonna win because red didn't put him down. This is embarrassing. Red does have a set on five, though. Bad dice, bad dice, bad dice. Fail, fail the, fail the roll. Just fail the roll. Just fail the roll and give it to red. Yes, yes, yes. Oh my god. Dude. Maybe blue was banking on the set on three. If blue didn't set on three there, I win the game every, every time, every day of the week. Oh, man, we have the guaranteed set on three. And if we didn't set early with the wild card, we, dude, we had two cards and we had the most troops. There was no reason for blue to kill us other than the fact that he knew red and purple were paper bags that he could beat in a 1v1. <laughs> oh, my gosh. All right, blue. Come on, buddy. Bring it home. Bring it home, my guy. Walks his stack. Where would you put that? Block? Okay. Oh, I didn't like that. I definitely would have left that open just in case Red red cheeses you. But Red has this in the bag now, right? Come on, Gene or Jean. Come on, buddy. Don't let him trash talk with the good luck. You got this. You got this. Put it all here and then boomerang follow like this. Don't go this way. Yes, good man. Good man. Just like that. 
You got it. Yes, yes. Good job. Good job, guys. Wow. Oh my goodness. Yep. I love it. I love it. I love it. I'm so happy Blue doesn't get the win for suing into me. That's what that's amazing, dude. Red Red <laughs> was not likely. If you were betting on the horse, Red was not going to get your money. And he gets the dub, though. That's the beauty of this. And even if he fails the kill here, uh, he's got the card advantage. So, in the end, Blue does beat me, but he fails to win because of it, which is amazing. Oh, but Red is so... Red is a paper bag. Oh, my God. Oh, dude, this is, like, the third smallest map, and he can't even trace. Oh, I'm sorry, Red, but that's just rough. That's rough. Or he's just taunting it. I don't know. Yep. All right. I need this to hurry up, guys, so I can get the ranks. Uh, if I if I lose if I leave right now, it won't show me the ranks. It'll just send me straight to the the dashboard, if you will. All right. But yeah, incredible game. There we go, Blue. Come on, buddy. There it is. GGs. GGs. Come on, Red. Please just win the game, my guy. Please just win the game. It gets another set on three. <laughs> oh my gosh. Very fun one to rewatch. I wonder if there was something else I could have done. Um, other than sue into blue and then feed the game to red just like he did to me, which I was unwilling to do. Um, yeah, if he had failed the kill too, if he got bad dice... Okay, Red, you're an absolute dum-dum. Like, seriously, you're not good. There's no reason you should be trying to showboat. You're not good, dude. You're just wasting everybody's time. You're just wasting everybody's time at this point, and now Blue's going to bot out, and it's going to cost us another two minutes. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. That's not, yeah, you're, you're not cool. You're not cool, bro. You are not cool. Hurry up and end the game. Take your very rare win. <laughs> oh my gosh. But yeah, on rewatch, I'm interested to see if there was something different I could have done in that situation. Maybe not go for the green kill. But if not, I think blue might have got it. Yeah. Well, no, green goes after me, right? So maybe I should have just bought... Oh, you know, maybe I should have killed blue early. Maybe I should have sued into blue. But then I'm pretty confident green would have killed me. Um, it's very interesting looking back. I don't know. I think it all came down to Blue not setting on three, actually. If Blue didn't set on three, he couldn't have done that. He couldn't have sued into me. He could have sued, but it would have killed me. It would have left me with, like, 30 or 40 troops, and then I could have easily mopped the floor. All right, Red. Just hit the, hit the troops. Thank you. All right. Let's see these ranks. I'm expecting beginner novice across the board, but I will take any higher ranks if you would like to give them. Oh my god, it was just me and a bunch of beginners. <laughs> As always, thank you so much for your time. I really do appreciate it, and I will catch you on the flip. Peace.